James Cribbs, Ham Radio Prep. Got that coming up next. Bill from Ham Radio Basics here. If you like the content of this video or anything on my channel, make sure you hit the subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any future content. With that, let's begin. Hamcation 2024 wrapped up on Sunday and it was without any doubt a successful event. We had a great time there. One of the things I was able to do was to be able to get around to talk to several of the vendors. I was able to spend some time with the CEO of Ham Radio Prep, James Cribbs, and we asked about changes that are coming up regarding the amateur extra course that he has. So without any further ado, let's roll that clip in its entirety. Hey, what's going today? on, Bill? I want to talk to you for a few minutes. Is of that course, okay? of on, course. Got you on camera. Yeah. Wanted to, I know, I know, I know your, your great cohort will be here probably a little bit later, but he was leaking out some information about uh, a tweak in the amateur extra. Is that, is that what I'm hearing? Yes, yes, the amateur extra is coming along. It's, uh, if you're studying for amateur extra right now, you, get, you got until uh, July 1st, so June 30th, July 1st is when the new question pool takes over. So this question pool here is good through July, uh, June 30th, 2024. Gotcha. Now, it's not that different. Uh, in fact, it's got a little bit more things on digital. There's about 20% of the questions that are different. The question pool size is getting a little bit smaller okay. overall. So it's kind of a good thing, but um, the good thing for everybody that signed up with Ham Radio Prep is you get the new course for free. So if you got all access pass or you already bought Amateur Extra, you don't have to buy it again, or if you buy it now and then you don't get around to it, it's lifetime access and you get the new course for free. So well, it takes I'm, it easy. That, you can't beat that. And I'll tell you what, I'm probably your number one YouTube fan out there, okay? I'm your number one fan. I'm period. your number one fan, and you, you okay. actually got me on a live stream, which I hadn't done before, so I kind of... I kind of finally I, made it happen. I got so much positive response from them. It was it was absolutely fantastic having you on. And you guys, well, we work hard. I mean, we it's a it's a lot of work, as you can imagine, to build these courses and to make them good. But we know on the one end, you've got people that are just you're just taking quizzes and you're not really learning. And then the other then they just kind of throw a textbook at you, say, "Hey, read this textbook." We try to go right down the middle where it's you're watching a video, you're learning something. But our main goal is just to get more people licensed and on the air and get more people upgraded in general so you can actually start doing some of the HF stuff exactly. and start having fun. That's what I'm, I'm kind of into just tinkering with the HF. That's my kind of favorite thing. I mean, I do a little bit of VHF, UHF locally, but mostly for me, once I got into HF, that's, that's where the real fun started. Well, I'll tell you what, I really liked it when you came out with the HF course. That was that was a real winner right there. Absolutely yeah. love that because you know so many people they'll pass, they'll get their general, they're ready to get into HF, and it's like, what do I do? What what transceiver do I get? What antennas do I get? You know, yeah. boom. And then your your gem of a guy here puts a outstanding he video. He is on. absolutely yeah. phenomenal. I mean, he's the best professor in ham radio oh my hands God. down because yeah. he understands how to break these complicated concepts down and make it something that you can understand. I mean. If you want to go deep on something, you can, but you need to get the base level kind of established first. Jim is actually a part of Eris as well, so he's doing a whole talk at Eris wow. right now. But he'll be back at the booth, but he's just, I mean, he's an overall just advocate for amateur radio overall. Question of the day. What did you think of Hamcation 2024 James Cribbs Ham Radio Prep? Let me know in the comments section below. Thanks so much for watching, and remember, it's a great day to make a QSO. 7-3s, everybody.